Evolution of Baragon In the 1965 debut movie Frankenstein vs. Baragon, an 82-foot Baragon is shown as a skilled burrower monster that evolved from the mythical dinosaur Baranaz dragon and burrowed underground to escape the extinction of the dinosaurs and other prehistoric species. He adapted and survived over the years, but when the sounds of a neighboring factory disturb and awaken him during the movie's events, Baragon emerges from underground and attacks the factory. He later strikes and destroys a village and consumes all of a farm's livestock. Because Baragon was not seen in the attacks, the mutant human Frankenstein was accused instead, until a survivor of the factory attack came forward, claiming a different monster had attacked him. While searching for Frankenstein, a group of scientists detonated explosives, attracting Baragon. He attacks the scientists, but the Frankenstein arrives to save them. Baragon is shown to be able to fire a flame ray from his mouth that is extremely weak, which does not even damage Frankenstein. However, it was strong enough to cause forest fires. The horn on his snout glows from time to time and crackles when he uses it. In the 1968 movie Destroy All Monsters, a different, smaller Baragon, 65 feet tall, appears as one of several of Earth's monsters held in captivity on Monster Island at the end of the 20th century. He vanished after the alien Kilox invaded the island and seized control of the monsters. Baragon later appears at Mount Fuji during the battle between the Earth monsters and King Ghidorah, but doesn't participate in it. In the 1971 movie Godzilla vs. Hedora, Baragon appears only as a toy. In the 1978 movie Adi Yog, Baragon appears only in stock footage. An orange Baragon appears in the TV show Get Going, Godzilland, where he is one of Godzilla's best friends, alongside Ngiris and Rodan. When Baragon saw Mechagulla kidnap Ngiris, he told Godzilla about it and later assisted him, along with the rest of the monsters, in saving Ngiris. In the TV show Godzilla Island, Baragon appears as an ally of Godzilla and lives with other monsters on Godzilla Island. He always helps Godzilla protect the island from the invasion of the zillion aliens and their monsters. In the 2001 movie Godzilla, Mothra and King Ghidorah, giant monsters all out attack, a 98-foot Baragon is shown as one of Japan's three ancient guardian monsters who were killed years prior by Japanese soldiers who prayed for them to return to save Japan. When Godzilla is revived by the vengeful souls of the people who died in World War II, Baragon and his fellow guardians, Mothra and King Ghidorah, are revived to battle with him, with Baragon attacking first. The battle was vicious, and Baragon did his best to fight an immensely powerful and savage Godzilla, but ultimately ended up being vaporized by Godzilla's heat ray. Although three monsters were defeated, they managed to weaken Godzilla enough for Admiral Taizo Tachibana of the Japan Self-Defense Forces JSDF to kill him in turn. In the 2004 movie Godzilla Final Wars, Baragon makes a short appearance in stock footage. In the TV show Godzilla Singular Point, Baragon appears on a cell phone case in the episode Tigerish, Nobe's Terror, 